There will soon be another choice for air travelers who are leaving from Austin Straubel International Airport. Yeah, Delta announcing today that starting in June, it will offer a daily round trip, non stop flight between Ashwaubenon and Atlanta. The flight will leave Austin Straubel at 6 in the morning, return to Titletown a little bit after 8 in the evening. Fox 11's Eric Peterson was at the announcement today, and Eric, finally, this flight is coming back. That's right, Tom. The announcement was about a year in the making, and that daily flight actually reconnects Green Bay with the world's busiest airport. Now, the same service was canceled in 2008 because of high fuel costs and low airfares. And even with the flight's return, the convenience comes with a cost. The flight to Atlanta will feature a 65-passenger jet, complete with Wi-Fi and food service. Ravine says she'll check out the flight. I have two children, one in Tampa and one in Washington, D.C., that the quicker we get to the destination, the better it is, and the more flights available would be super. Airport leaders and tourism officials made the announcement Monday. They say the nonstop flight will be convenient for business people. They're trying to fly speakers in. People that are coming to their conference are trying to get in. You need to have quality air service. But how much will this flight cost? We called Delta to find out what the cost for the new flight from Austin Straubel would be. The company said it would not speculate on fares six months out. We checked Delta's website for flights leaving Tuesday for Atlanta for a one-passenger economy class round-trip ticket. From Milwaukee, nonstop to Atlanta will cost $533. Out of Gamey County Regional Airport in Greenville offers two daily nonstop flights to Atlanta. Cost of the ticket is $748. Austin Straubel offers a connecting flight to Detroit before heading to Atlanta for $875. Nonstop service is really a, a preferred uh, flight rather than uh, having to make a connection, even if the price is a little bit higher. Kathy Gravine says she'll continue to search for the best deals. I look at two frequent flyer miles, not so much that, but my charge card um, that I set aside to and save that up for discounts on my flights. Delta made the investment. Area leaders say it will be up to the business leaders to promote the flight. We needed to sell them on the fact that our community is a strong, vibrant community that's growing and that the demand is going to be there and that we're going to be able to fill the seats on those aircraft. Now this will be the second nonstop flight to Atlanta from northeast Wisconsin. Airport directors at both Outagamy Regional and Austin Straubel say they aren't worried about direct competition. They say there's enough business for each airport to go around.